All right, the first step we're going to take here when learning a jazz standard, in this case Just Friends, is to learn the chords. So right now I'm just going to take you through the chords of the song. So get your lead sheet up. You'll notice we're in the key of G major. Okay, and the chord C major 7th is the first chord, the 4 chord. All right, here's your C major 7th. Okay, for two measures. And then we go to C minor for two measures. Now watch this, how easy it is to get right to G major 7th from here. Your first finger goes up to G, and these three slide back to G major 7th. So this is a very economical position right here to play this in. That's for two measures. Now B flat diminished. Okay, right there, B flat in the bass, just like in the chord guide. Now A minor 7th for one measure, D 7th for one measure, B minor 7th for one measure, E minor 7th for one measure. Doesn't that sound nice? I love that change. And now to the two dominant, A7. Now if we notice, this is the same fingering as the minor 7th chord, only a different set of strings. Okay, as evidenced in that chord guide as well. So two measures on the A seventh, and then one measure on A minor seventh, one measure on D seventh. Now this tune is made up of two halves, two 16 measure second sections. So the second half, once again, starts on the C major seventh for one me uh, two measures. Then C minor for two measures, G major seventh once again for two measures, and then B flat diminished for two measures. And once again, A minor seventh for one measure, D seventh for one measure, the same as the first half. B minor seventh, one measure, E minor seventh, one measure, A seventh, one measure, D seventh, one measure, and G major seventh for the last chord. Okay, the turnaround chord is a G seventh. The turnaround chord is when you're playing more than one chorus. You'll put the G seventh in there to get back to the beginning, back to that C major seventh. Okay, so those are your basic chords to this song, Just Friends. We're going to put the track on now. There's a four measure introduction. I will count you in. And whenever a chord changes, we're going to strike the chord together. We're not going to use any rhythm yet in the, in the picking hand. We'll get to that in the comping sections. All right, so let's put the track on and play through these chords. Make sure we have them. There's a four measure introduction. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Here we go. C minor. Major seventh. B flat diminished. A minor seventh. D seventh. B minor seventh. E minor seventh. A seventh. Two measures. A minor seventh. D seventh. One measure each. Back to C major seventh. For two measures. C minor. The four minor. One chord, G major seventh, and B flat diminished, A minor seventh, D seventh, now B minor seventh, E minor, A seventh, D seventh, G, and then G seventh. Let's do it one more time, and I won't say anything. sound we want to get.
right, great. Let's move on to the melody now. 